Uh, okay, so I played the Grand Summoners for a good like <laughs> a good eight hours. The video that I posted the other day, I started talking about Dungeon of Trials, and if you guys want a video over that, and maybe. I go through all the stuff and just talk about them and I, I just want to go ahead and say if I do post that video I'm just gonna go ahead and say it right now like with the teams and everything for Dungeons and Trials with the higher floors and everything like that It's not new player friendly like new player teams and everything like that. I mean You're not gonna really run. <laughs> you're not gonna be able to it's just in-game content at that point like this floor right here i spent probably the eight hours when i was playing this i probably spent most of my time playing <laughs> floor 26 because my team just kept on getting out of here right here man where my mouse is at bro right there my team was getting out every single time dude i didn't want to use my old team that i passed it before with gerald so i wanted to use a new team and yeah so <laughs> i wouldn't say ignis is not even that hard it's just she has hellfire going on the whole time our gauge up like when did she ever have our gauge up we have ramiro and syphilette there so in terms of this getting inflicted with burn or anything else any status alignment we're good right we don't need any cradles or anything like that we have ramiro and syphilette on the team so you're gonna be good you don't have to worry about that but the thing is esj once you put it on hard tail bro it's already gonna be hard for Harto to go through it because he's an earth character so a lot of planning a lot of talking to ren and everything because like my characters kept on getting out of here for no reason man for no reason so yeah i stopped at floor 26 because i was one i was bored out of my mind two i was tired of playing grand summoners for that long like all these floors are completed we're really not gonna touch like these lower floors right here man so we're on floor 27 i do want to break palamecia because palamecia is floor 27 but i'm not for sure how i want to do it this is not the equipment that's supposed to be a war goal <laughs> what is that i had to auto equip this bro <laughs> But yeah, I did want to break, but Pabicia has this thing in this floor. The blizzard is going to the fight, and it's harder for you to get R gauge because she slows R gauge down or your team getting R gauge. So it's really, really annoying. And then, you know, you want to know the number one secret. I give you the secret right now. If I don't do the video over Dungeons and Trials, I give you the secret right now. And this is only for the people that have been playing this game for a very long time or played it during a certain time. If you have a Serpa, <laughs> you can go through the Dungeons and Trials easy. The art, so good. The equipment slots so good like if i had a serpa my life would be 10 times easier going through dungeon of trials i guarantee it to be honest in some of these floors you can run harto a serpa syphilette damage dealer you're fine you're you're literally good a serpa syphilette damage dealer bro you're a fine bro i know ren he like breaks nuke and everything like that if i do the video i'm gonna talk about that and everything in terms of breaking the boss it kind of sucks because you know i want to use a tank like miranda but the thing is i'm telling you when that r gets to slow up on y'all it's, it, it's you're done for it's not even that to be honest so you have to inflict a uh, disease poison or whatever on palamecia so that's why i have alabina here but once you get right here, Palmecia is going to art. <laughs> and that's, it, 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 you're fine. The art, like right here is when really your art gauge is really going to start being slow. But right here, Palmecia is going to art on that, on that last stage, bro. And it's in terms of whether you can survive it or not. And that's the thing. I'm trying to find a way to survive it without a tank. <laughs> Cause last time I had a tank. So I'm trying to do something different, but I don't think it's possible, bro. I actually, I actually been playing this game a lot and I'm destiny Two DLC comes out next week. Like I, like I, I was so upset because I was trying to figure out new teams for this. And I started playing for so long and I was like, I'm going to do my homework today. I didn't do it. Like, <laughs> even though my homework is due in a couple of days, I have a, enough time to do it. I like doing it early, go ahead and get it over with and everything like that. So I don't forget about it. And I was just like, no, Grand Summoners. <laughs> so yeah, I played this thing for way too long. We're going to see how this goes. Uh, I know some people wanted uh, me to do some videos over some floors. You might see a video soon.